How's it going guys welcome back to another FIFA 17 mobile video and today guys I'm gonna tell you about how the transfer market works this year also I'm gonna talk about whether you can buy FIFA coins from FIFA websites whether you can purchase FIFA coins whether you can help your friends by trading coins with them whether you can sell your press for cheaper to your friends and stuff like that so let's just begin guys let's just begin where there's well actually there's a lot to talk about on the transfer market this year so let's just start by resetting everything on the transfer market let's just search up now guys one thing that you can easily notice is that most of the players that you'll find on the transfer market are like you know on the similar price now i'm gonna list this player i could list him off for any price now i'm gonna just list him off for 3000 coins starting and 4000 coins by now but he's a silver so he'll probably not get sold for a high price like that i mean that's not high but that is also not what silvers usually sell for now i'm gonna sell, search for this guy and i will surely not find my player there even if anyone in the world will search for him at the time that i post him he will not be there that is because he is not put up right there at that time it's like when you put up players ea will be able to see them only ea ea sports fifa will only be able to see them now they will buy the players from you if they think that the coins you have put them for is like the market price now if i'm just gonna put them put this up for like you know two or 10 million or and 20 million by now this will probably not show up for anyone whether you are on the server in the us whether you are on the server in the canada whether you're on the server in the asian server doesn't matter so this player will only be shown for me even ea will probably not even see it or they might just see it and ignore it but they will not list him up on the market so how the transfer market works this year guys ea buys your players once you list them and if they are for a decent price ea will buy them and then they'll list them for whatever price they want to list them so that's why you will not be able to see your players when you list them your friends cannot see your players when you list them and nobody else in the world can see your players when you when you list them now the transfer market also it doesn't matter actually um let me just talk about this so if you are living imagine if you're living in the us and your friend if he just like like he's your right door neighbor like you know across the street or something he just lives pretty close to you then he will be able to check your players because you are probably in the same server now i don't know how the servers work this year on the fifa well on nba it is i guess region wise the server so there's like four or five servers in nba i don't know about the fifa servers so even if you're on android and your friend is on ios he can still search for your players but they will not be your players anymore they'll be ea's players so they will not be for the same price that you listed them for they'll be for maybe a higher price or maybe a cheaper price we don't know but they will just be there for a different price at a different point of time so when after you you know in the middle of the auction if your players are bought it is ea buying them not some person randomly in the world who's buying them it is at that point of time that ea, EA has bought them that is exactly why all of these players are already there on the market it doesn't mean someone has put them it's because ea has put them in exactly why on the first day of the release there were so many messi's and ronaldo's on the market now there's all these players on the market that probably no one has completed live events for you cannot complete a robin event already you need like 18 tokens or something of robin you need like five or six elite trophies now this you can bid on the players and that is going to be other world players bidding and other world players buying the players but it's not going to be them listing it's going to be them listing but then ea buying it from them and then ea listing it somewhere else probably not even the same server that they bought it from maybe they bought it from someone who lives in the us using an android device and then they list it up in the uk and the people in the uk can see it with an android device it's not like you live in the us and 
if you're on android device the person or even on ios devices can see it maybe they can if they if ea lists them in the same place that is why guys it is not possible to buy fifa coins this year from any fifa coins website now guys that's all for today's video i hope you enjoyed that and if we did be sure to get the video to three likes it is gonna be tough guys but we can do this Destruction.